Right, hello and welcome to the JEAFX trading course. First of all, I want to say thank you for choosing me for your trading education. It means a lot to me that you enjoy my work and enjoy my trading style. And I also want to say congratulations for investing in yourself. Now, that's a step that a lot of people do not take, stepping out of your comfort zone and investing money into education. But it is a very wise step and it's going to put you miles ahead in your Forex trading career by giving you the knowledge and the mindset that you actually need to succeed. So the course has six chapters and in this video, I'm just gonna run through what each one of those is going to entail. And then we'll actually move into it, we'll move into the learning. So the first is the introduction. And this is gonna be an introduction to Forex. What we're gonna do is talk through my processes. We'll talk through my approach to the market, and we're going to cover my five core principles of successful trading. Now, this is something that I think every trader should develop their own core principles, uh, things that they believe, you know, are going to drive them to success and just things to live by. OK. We're also going to get you set up, give you a trading platform, tools and a broker. The idea of looking at that, uh, getting you actually ready to place trades so that throughout the course you can do your homework. And then when you come to the end of the course, you can actually go out there with your trading plan and uh, smash the markets with the right platforms and good brokers. So in chapter two, we're going to talk about trading psychology. Now we'll talk about the importance of psychology. It might be something overlooked, but it, psychology is a very big part of trading, okay? We'll talk about why we have to master our mind, how that's so important and how that's gonna make or break you. Emotions, of course, are a big part of psychology. So we're gonna talk about how you can actually control your emotions and kill mental barriers that hold you away from success. We'll dive into personal development and talk about becoming the best you. Now that is something you're gonna to have to do. Trading runs much deeper than the charts. You have to become the best version of yourself if you want to perform best and succeed. When we've spoken about psychology, we'll move into one of the most important aspects of trading, which is risk management. You'll learn how to manage your money for long-term success, the different processes and principles that I use myself and that you can use to manage your money, keep it safe and avoid large losses. We'll tie chapter two and three together by talking about the psychological side of risk management and the mindset side that's going to either make or break you with your processes. And we'll put together some rules and talk about being selective and setting guidelines with your trading to make sure that you do not over risk and over lose. When we have psychology and risk management in place, we'll move on to talk about fundamentals. So fundamentals are the economics behind the market. We'll learn what they are, how they affect the market and how you can manage economic and fundamental data with different levels of importance. We'll learn fundamental processes to trade with clarity and confidence in the markets when you actually take your trading to the charts. When fundamentals are all said and done, we will dive into technicals. We will look at the on-chart work to how to find successful trades. This is going to be by far the biggest chapter of the course. We'll talk through all of my processes and all of the methods I use on the charts to actually succeed. We'll incorporate fundamentals and talk about that balance between fundamentals and technicals. And we'll also make it clear how important risk and psychology are when brought into the technical area. And when all is said and done, we will talk about a trading plan and we'll show you how to actually set your own trading plan up. This includes targets and limits, making sure you're setting realistic goals, processes, the routines and the criteria that you're going to use to take execute and manage trades and how you can consistently update your trading plan and routinely develop your strategy for maximized results. So without further ado, let us dive into the course. And in the next video, we're going to talk about my personal approach to trading and how I look at the markets. So once again, thank you for choosing me. Congratulations for investing in yourself and I will see you in the next video.